Hi folks, it's Mike Murphy with a very simple organization tip in Adobe After Effects CC 2024. In this tutorial, I'm gonna show you how you can change the color labels or the little color swatch that you see next to any open composition on your timeline in your After Effects projects. And the main reason or purpose of why you might want to change the color label for your compositions is simply to keep things organized. Now you might already know just how easy it is to change the color labels for layers or for pre-comps in your composition. You just select a layer or multiple layers, click on the little color swatch next to the layer name and choose a new color. Works the exact same way for pre-comps. Just select the pre-comp, click on the color swatch and pick a new color. However, when you try to change the color swatch, so that little square that you see next to the composition name, nothing happens. To change the color label for any open composition on your timeline, just right click or control click on any empty space in your layers panel and choose reveal composition in project. You can also just click on the little hamburger menu next to your composition name and choose that same option, reveal composition in project once you click that, it's going to highlight or reveal the composition in your project panel. If you look below the search field to where it says name, if you just right click anywhere on this header bar, so I'll right click, choose columns, and then click on label. If I right click again, you'll see now there's a check mark next to label, which is exactly what we want. Now we're not seeing any difference, and that's because this project panel is too narrow it's hiding the label color column, which may be the reason why you never saw the option to change the composition color labels. So all we have to do to expand this column, if you just hover your cursor, you're gonna see it turns into this double arrow. Now all you have to do is just click and expand that column. Now we can see the label column. And if we wanna bring this closer to name, hover your cursor until you see the double arrow, click, now you can drag the color label column closer. We can hover our cursor between the panels again if you want to bring that back to make it smaller. And now you can click on the little color swatch just like you did in the layers panel. So I'll click, select a new color, and now you'll see the composition color label has been updated down in the timeline. Pretty cool. And to change the default composition color, that is automatically assigned whenever you create a new composition in After Effects. So currently, my default composition color is this sandstone. All you have to do is just click on the color label. It doesn't matter if you click on it down in the layers panel or in the project panel. Go to the very bottom of the list of labels and choose edit label colors. That is gonna open up your After Effects preferences or settings. You can get to this exact same menu if you go to the top menu, After Effects, Settings, and choose Labels. At the very top, you'll see Composition. Just click, and now you can select what color you want to be the default color. So if I choose blue, click OK. Now when I create a new composition, click OK. Blue is going to be the default color. So the recap. To change the color label for open compositions on your timeline, go up to the project panel, right click on the header, choose columns and click on label. If you're not seeing the label column, hover your cursor to expand the panel. So whenever you see that double arrow, you can click and expand until you see the color label. Then all you have to do is just click on the color swatch pick a new color and it will update down in the timeline. And that is your quick tip in Adobe After Effects CC 2024. My name is Mike Murphy. Cheers.